Now I'll play back. See if it looks good. There you go. That's uh, the basics of it. Now you, if you want to add, like, uh, a brush to it. So let me see. So you would click the brush tool here and select whatever brush you want. Uh, basically, if you want to download more brushes, you go to Google, uh, type in any brush you want. Uh, like example explosion br uh, brush you click that find it download it and then just install it and it'll automatically install it to Photoshop so I chose this one and you can change the color by clicking right here this orange one change it to any color you want I'm gonna pick blue so and you just click And it'll sh and it'll fade in with the opacity from the second layer that you started with. So that's pretty cool. That's how you add uh, brushes and let's say animate. That's the basics of it. So now I'm gonna open up one of mine that I already finished so let's go here uh, now this is one of mine that I made and basically I, I added um, two pictures one sniper and then one of uh, the barrels right here and then it should look something if you do it correctly it should look something like this or maybe not something like that but something that you want it to look like and that's how you animate it's uh, basically it's all about the frames uh, deselecting and selecting the layers to each frame and so deselect this it'll be gone on that frame so that's basically it so comment rate su subscribe uh, ask questions uh, anything you want and I'll answer it for you alright thanks for watching uh, hey some of you have been asking me how to render your animated signature so you go onto Photoshop and click on the file let's see you would go to file save for web and devices don't go to save as but save for web and devices and you would click save but before you click save you want to change the size because you don't want the, fi the picture to be 3 megabytes that's too big so let's see 600 by 500 sh that should be good and you click ok there we go now you go to file save for web and devices and now you click save save wherever you want to and call it whatever you want to Alright, say exit that. Uh, click yes. And now you press enter. Alright. 
Alright, so now you want to know how to upload it to a website. So you would open your your uh, browser and go to free free image hosting dot net and the Mac the max file size can only be three megabytes, which is like what I said earlier. You don't want it to be three megabytes, so uh, choose a file, choose the file that you saved, and you click upload. And now you click it. And there's the link for the picture. You save that somewhere so you don't lose it. And that's pretty much how you upload it to to the internet. Okay. Thanks for watching.